when you import images into OpenTunes, you'll often notice that there is a white border around the image. The reason for this is to do with the transparency of the image. All images in OpenTunes will be using the color format red, green, blue, and alpha. These colors will be multiplied by the alpha channel, and that is how transparency will be calculated. There's two ways in which you can calculate the alpha channel. Either you can calculate the alpha channel and the transparency after you've calculated the color, or you can calculate it before you've calculated the color. The advantage with calculating it after you've done the color is you'll have more accurate color. This is the default in OpenTunes. The advantage of calculating it before you calculate the color is you'll have more accurate transparency. The reason you will have less accurate color if you calculate the transparency beforehand is that computers are not actually very good at maths. And most image formats do not allow for a large fractional amount on the numbers. You have more modern formats like OpenEXR, but that's not currently supported in OpenTunes. And for 2D animation is probably overkill in any case. Now the problem with calculating the transparency after you've calculated the color is that you get artifacts along the borders where you have large amounts of transparency. While you generally have a slightly faster image and a slightly better qu color quality, you have transparency problems. As I said, the default is to calculate the transparency afterwards. What you need to do is calculate the transparency before that. So in the scene I have two layers. As you'll see we've got white borders over here. This is a transparent layer over there and these white borders in order to get rid of them you can either go to the drop down menu to access the level settings or you can go to the browser and access them from the browser. If we take a look at the level settings we will see that we have options over here, pre-multiply, white is transparent, add anti-aliasing. White is transparent will read white backgrounds in an image as transparent, but in this case I'm using PNG images where the alpha channel is calculating transparency. So in order to fix the backgrounds, I will just click on pre-multiply and you'll see there will no longer be the white artifacts around the borders of the image. 